Here's how to fix the side button or power button not working on your iPhone. Now, let's first just head into the settings here. Let's scroll down a little bit, tap on general, and then at the very bottom, hit the shutdown button. You'd be surprised how many times a bug or a glitch is fixed just by turning off your phone and restarting it. It could have been days or weeks without a proper turn off and reboot. Now, if that side button is still isn't working, we're gonna hit transfer or reset and hit reset all settings at the very top. So just enter in the passcode here for your phone. Keep in mind all of your contents, all your text messages, photos, all that stuff will still be there, but it will bring all of your settings back just the to the factory default. And a lot of times fix that side button. If it's still causing you issues, let's go back out of here tap on software update and see if there's an update to the iOS operating system. You can see it's currently at iOS 18.2. So just update for your phone to the latest version and that should fix any bugs or glitches in that side button. Now, the next thing I would recommend doing is seeing if there's a physical obstruction in that button itself. So take off the case if you have an iPhone case and just kind of clean around the area. Maybe get a little toothpick, maybe clean around the area to make sure that it is nice and clean so that it can be working and it's not the case that's causing the issue. The next thing I would recommend doing is heading back into your settings here. Let's go back here, tap on accessibility, and then we'll tap on touch. And at the very top, choose assistive touch. You can turn on assistive touch here and you can see it creates this little menu. I can tap on it and it gives me a bunch of different options here that I can control. I can hit customize top level menu and hit plus here. So I can do stuff like Apple Pay if I wanted to use that assistive touch for Apple Pay because this side button isn't working. Or if I wanted to take a screenshot, I can use this to take a screenshot. I have a bunch of different options to use this assistive touch even though this physical button is no longer working. Now, the last thing I would recommend doing is if it really bothers you and all of these steps don't get it fixed, just take it into an Apple store. They'll plug it in, run some diagnostics to see what the issue is with that side or power button. They might need to physically replace it or replace your iPhone, or maybe just fixing the software or reinstalling the iOS operating system will get it all fixed. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks.